Okay, so we come to a, a, another simple explanation of the structure of mind. Again, you need to understand the three triangles. Now, this triangle, or if you start off with this circle, this circle represents the world. The virtual reality in our minds that represents the world. A projection of the world. And obviously in the world, we have position. All the objects are in a position, and we have our own position, which we know as posture. And then different postures lead to different actions. So as we move around in this world, we touch objects, and we also project the idea of solidity. So we, we don't need to touch everything to know it's solid and real. And then we gain that from a few objects, we put a few objects, and so we build up an image of the world through this. So we have the pressure map of the world from the moving around in the world. The pressure of the touch, defining objects, you know, the flow of objects through our hands as we work and create, and then identifying the object and its position in the world. So that this is it, we move around in the objects, we get a view of the world, the reality of everything. And then the next level, we move around in space and time. This is our schedule, um, you know, being in the right place at the right time, moving from one place to another place. So we have the energy there. Now this is the, the you know, is the audio signal, this vibration, sustained vibration is the audio signal. But on the you know the macro level it's the schedule in the right place in the right place at the right time. And there we are moving. So that's our experience, you see, moving around and feeling the objects and then moving around from uh, position to position over time. And then we have the, this is the attention, attention triangle. You know, we see, there we are, the vision, the avatar, the driver, or the ego. We can see movement, or we can see faces. But it is our attention, our attention follows the movement and identifies faces. So we have the movement of the attention, the movement of from time to time with the cycles of time, daily, monthly, yearly, just our appointments, our daily schedule. And then we have the moving around of the objects in the reality. Now these are the three levels, the moving of the attention, the moving of time from place to place, and the moving around in the space and feeling the objects. 